morning everybody, Handleman here. We're just going to feed everybody in our indoor aquaponics system. I'll give you a little update here as well. So everyone is ready to roll. I come in the room and they're all like, Dude! Where's the food? Dude! Dude! Hi Leah. Alright, take it easy. I'm going to give everyone some food. Today I'm just going to feed them all some koi food. And I'll let you see all the fishes before the chaos from me putting the food in there. It's got two large beautiful koi in there. Well, I mean, not super large. They're large compared to when I got them. A bunch of, uh, these are just feeder goldfish and they're getting huge. Some of these feeder goldfish are over like four and a half inches. And then I've got some bluegills and then I've got some uh, black bullhead catfish. You can see one of the baby catfish down there right in the center. But uh, they're doing very, very well in this system. Everyone's doing well. I haven't lost a fish the entire time and I put this together in November and now it's uh, February I haven't lost a single fish yet and then the turtles got a permit to have these raider sliders in here and they're just doing great in here too you guys you always move your branches dang it and then um so there's a few important updates to our to our grow beds here so I've showed you in part one and two of building the indoor aquaponics system how I built you know, built this, put this together. There's the pump, goes into the trash can. There's loofah sponges in there to um, to create kind of like a filter media for bacteria to grow. And then it goes through these two beds. And I had these expanded clay pellets, um, and the water was just going through them. And this worked wonderfully outside in my backyard. I had a system just like this, and all the plants grew right in the pellets. Indoors here, for some reason, it's not working. So what I've decided to do was starting to lose all my plants so I made two changes change number one I got actual grow lights that I ordered from Amazon so these are ideal for growing plants indoors so I switched out the normal LED lights that I had with these grow lights and already I think the plants seem to seem to have perked up a lot and now also I put down kind of a black weed barrier I took you know in this bed I'm trying it in this bed first so what I did was I removed about three more inches of these uh, clay pellets and then I put down a black weed barrier and then I put in this organic um, potting soil um, and what I did also was I poked a hole through the weed barrier uh, one two three and then the back one two three and then I have nylon ropes to use as wicks so I totally changed this into a wicking bed and um, you can see here's a piece of the rope basically so in each spot the rope comes up and then I freight it and it goes out into like several different directions below the surface. Here's here's one of them right here. Let me just get that buried again a little bit. So so far I transferred this is garlic and it's coming up. I transferred comfrey, here's a comfrey coming up, and then I planted jalapenos and this is lemon balm. So over here is the lemon balm. On this side is the uh the jalapenos and the lemon balm is already starting to come up you can see there's little I don't know if you can see in the light but oh now you can see so it's starting to come up so I'm very very optimistic with our system now let me go grab the food sometimes I feed them turtle food sometimes I just feed them koi food this is just bulk koi food that I got at the feed store watch them go ballistic you ready here we go Watch the fish go crazy. And usually after two minutes of the food being in there, the big bullhead catfish starts to come out. Give the turtles some. I don't want them to feel left out. The turtles actually get mad at me if I don't feed them. All right, here. <clears throat> here they all come. A bunch of terrors.
right, guys. Hope you enjoy this little update. Has the big bull head out yet? No, nope, he's not coming out. Sometimes he won't come out during the day at all, even if I feed him. Yeah. Oh, no, he is out. He is out. There he is. There's the big bull head. He's coming up. He's coming up. All right, thanks for watching this, guys.